Welcome, welcome. I am G Paul Silvermane, and this is a Marvel Strike Force video. This one's all about power cores. I've been seeing a lot of talk and chatter in the Discord um, about what to buy with these power cores. And there's tons of people out there that think they should go in and uh, purchase some orbs and such. And I just want to, want to tell you what I think you should do and why. Um, not much to this video. I just want to get my personal perspective out there and uh, maybe warn a few people as to what they shouldn't do um supplies here so these orbs are awfully tempting right it's showing you death pull and kestrel but they don't they don't really drop and 450 cores is a lot of cores don't i highly recommend you don't buy ever buy any orb in here ever um you're gonna get domino or you're gonna get uh ant-man that comes from blitz orbs out of these you're not gonna get ghost and yellow jacket and stuff not very often anyway again if you were like five shards away or something um, from starring someone up, you could make a personal decision type of deal. But honestly, even then, I wouldn't even do it. Um, the gold orbs are not worth it um, at all. There's actually an offer they they uh, put out where it's like three gold orbs for 900 cores. So if you're just needing gold that bad and you spend tons of money in this game, then absolutely. But I'm talking more to the free-to-play uh, player right now or the mid-game player or the person that doesn't spend a ton. Someone similar to me. And I spend, I buy the Battle Pass and Strike Pass. And I don't buy any of these orbs. I, They are not worth it for value, everybody out there. Um, something that I think you could save them for is these events. These events last 15 days, 14. Yeah, it's like 14 or 15 days, right? 15 days usually for like, I, I believe uh, Spider-Punk will be our next one, is what I believe. And uh, not positive on that or nothing, but you spend these 200 cores a day refreshing it while spending 200 cores on your regular energy refreshes. That's 400 cores a day for 15 days. That's 6,000 cores. Um, you are going to accumulate cores back steadily. You're going to get your, about your 200 cores intake if you're in the top 250 of Alliance. So you can counter product or counteract some of that, but you're gonna your power cores are going to dwindle. This is on my level 68 free to play. Um, and I got it back up to 4,000, which is almost exactly where my level 61 uh, free to play account that I uh, do my day to day series on. It's about back up to 4,000. You know, I I took it down to like five power cores on the first event, and I came up three shards short. So, um, and I spent on everything you shouldn't spend on. I spent on tons of refreshes. I did everything under the sun to get Cersei, and I'm seeing the repercussions of not getting her. It's not good um, at all. But uh, I just, I want to not warn you or not. I want to inform you that it's not of good value to spend them in here. If you're going to spend them on like one of these new stores that they bring out sometimes for the 50 core refreshes, that's something to save for. Or if you need somebody out of the war store um, to go in and refresh that and have it pop up or teal gear or something maybe, that would be a better use of your 50 cores, honestly. Um, and even then, I don't like to refresh the store unless the game, like they made us with Icarus, have to refresh. That's the only way I would refresh in the store. And I didn't, that was total, in my opinion, that was messed up. Making us spend the premium currency that... You have to buy with money, or you barely get any of, to get spend your currency that you earned, your spare essence stuff, on Icarus shards. That was just ridiculous, in my opinion. Um, I believe power cores, you, you really only want to spend them on these four core refreshes here, until it gets to 100, and then when there's a, a event unlock for a character, it takes 3,000 cores. So, And that's if you do the 200 cores each day. Um, so bear that in mind. It's just something, I would say, keep your cores, hoard them. They are giving us a ton right now. They made a mistake, so they gave out another 1400 um, As well as it's around Christmas, and generally at the holidays, they give you some really good deals. Like 10 for 10 in here, you'll see 10 power cores for um, 10 items. 10 T4s or 10, 10 something awesome something. 10 shards of a premium character um, for 10 cores and stuff. You'll see a lot of that. Or one power core, like in that last event, where they were giving us orbs and gold orbs and all sorts of good stuff for one power core. Um, save your power cores, please. Um, it'll help your account so much. And if you go and blow these on those 450 orbs over here in the supply section, it's just going to hinder your account. And you're going to, I promise you, you'll regret it later if you're going to continue playing the game. You're going to be like, I wish I had those cores back. Especially if you you don't spend money on the game. Um, now, if you're spending a significant amount of money or you can buy a core pack, that's that's totally different. But even then, I would not spend them here. It's There's way better ways. I'd do 100 core refreshes on energy and stuff before I would ever buy these orbs. Um, but that's just a little... That's my opinion. It's a little information. Um, I hope you can get some use out of it. I hope you can see it from where I'm coming from. Um, 
because I, absolutely I I love opening orbs and I want to get that premium death pool and uh, I believe I'll get ghost out of here but there's four other bad characters you know it's, it's just not good and the gold you're going to get like 150 to 200k gold for 450 power cores that's a terrible value um, it's not worth it at all um all right, that's all I got. I just want to touch on that. Power cores are so, so important. And these events that they're doing, um, they might come freak more frequently. So they did do that where they had one two days after the last one ended or something like that, or like two weeks after the last one ended. Silver Samurai straight into Cersei. And I'll tell you what, if I didn't have money to spend, I wouldn't have been able to get her on my main account. And I buy the Strike Pass and Battle Pass. That's how strapped for cords I was. And I never buy these orbs out of the, out of the store here, so... Just something to think about, a little food for thought. Uh, much love, stay healthy. We'll see you in the next one.